From the very beginning, volunteers have been the lifeblood of the YMCA. In 1844, George Williams launched the Y movement in London, England. He was a volunteer. In 1890, a gospel wagon coordinated by volunteers was used to transport men from the streets of Fort Worth to rented YMCA facilities. The downtown Y was built in 1924 with volunteer Eamon G. Carter Sr. laying the cornerstone. Volunteers raised the funds to make the YMCA programs happen and build facilities. A longtime YMCA volunteer, Lofton Witcher recalls his first YMCA experience thanks to his mother. She didn't know really what to do with me, so she brought me to the Y. So I came down here in 1939, and uh, at that time, it cost $6 a year. You know, you divide <coughs> $6 by the 250 times I came. <laughs> it, was a, it was a pretty reasonable experience. Throughout the early 20th century, YMCA volunteers played a key role as the organization provided for men and women in the military. As World War II was ending, volunteer Alan Howarth came to the Y as a six-year-old with an interest in one particular game. Uh, I would come down here, for example, there used to be a lot of pool tables down here. And as a you know, six or seven, eight-year-old, you played on the little pool tables. And I thought, someday I'm going to be 12 years old and I get to play in the big pool table. And that was something that kept me coming back. Volunteer Vernon Evans has been a YMCA volunteer for 40 years. When I became on the board, I got exposed really to the programs to see really the difference that the Y was making in the community. I get a lot of joy from this. You know, I get very, very excited about the YMCA. You know, I put a lot of energy into it. And like I say, I, I, I'm excited about what the YMCA is doing for the community. I think I kind of owe the wife something, you know, that I guess maybe it's a paying back, you know. And this was my home. I mean, it, it, it was a big part of my life. Feeling satisfaction that what, what you're doing as a volunteer is producing uh, benefits for the community. And in the early years, it produced direct benefits for our family. Today, nearly 3,000 volunteers serve the Y annually. Without their support, our Y would not be able to carry out our programs and impact our community in the same way. Our volunteers, truly the roots of our YMCA.